Today, Mrs. Valor is going to read you a story about Lucky. Have fun! Yay! Hey, everybody. We're going to write a story today. We're practicing paragraphs. And when you write a paragraph, and we don't do this too much in second grade, but when you get into high school and even, you know, higher grades like fifth grade, you're going to be writing papers that have lots of paragraphs. So the important thing to remember with a paragraph is that the way that you know it's a paragraph is it starts with an indent. This is called an indent. That means the word doesn't start to the side of the page like we usually have it. Instead, what I always do is, I do my indents with about two fingers. I put my two fingers down, and then I start my word on the other side. Now, the important thing to remember is that an indent for a paragraph only happens with the first sentence. You'll notice on the next line, we went right back to the edge again. Okay, so that only happens with that first sentence. So here is the paragraph, and you'll also notice that in a paragraph, all the sentences are about the same topic. If you're starting a new topic, you need to start a new paragraph. Lucky is a little dog. Lucky's tail wags. He waits to go outside. He always likes to take a walk. When you copy this, I know your handwriting doesn't always match up exactly. Um, so if yours, if you get more room here, that's fine. Let's just make sure we all practice starting with our indent. And it might be easiest to just try to match your words with the books. So even if you don't usually leave this much space between words, maybe for this, just keep the same spacing as the handwriting without tears books okay so just go ahead and copy the whole paragraph and then take a minute and read it to someone at home <laughs> 